I could listen to Leonard all night long. I want to show you what I've been up to here in the backyard. This is solar garden pond number two. Dug it all out, put some edging in, transplanted a whole bunch of stuff that I had in pond number one and some stuff that I had out front. There's Coco drinking the water. She loves it. So hopefully, hopefully everything's going to survive. Those elephant ears there. And in this corner where I'm going to point here, is where we're going to put like a little reservoir with a water chute trough thing that's going to flow into the pond there. Now let's take a look at what it looked like before. Rifle through these pretty quickly. A lot of digging. It turned out pretty good. And see how I got it up a little bit higher there? That's so the dirt doesn't flow into the water when I'm watering. That really works out good. Look how green that is there. Look at the size of those elephant ears. Holy schmoly. And let's go over here and I'll do a little walk and talk about. This is of course pond number one. I did take some plants out of here, dug them up and put them in pond number two. And I'm going to actually wire up pond number two with my garden pond solar generator there. There's Clyde getting his... Uh, smells on. He just ate a whole bunch of grass and puked it up inside here. I'm not real happy with him, but that's all right. It's a little solar light. Shine on the bilge pump. A little bolt bilge pump in there powered by a solar generator. And those two Renergy solar panels up there. 200 watts. Real good. Working count really good with 200 watts. And I'm just kind of throwing stuff around here just gonna show you the uh, ran solar ovens here haven't been cooking much because we didn't ha haven't had much Sun there's Coco following me around like a good girl and pretty much the big picture here looking real good this year all right guys hey thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you next time with some more updates on this garden pond